Hey, yeah. Hello, Alicia. Hi. Um, this is interesting <laughs> because when you click Zoom uh, and you click record, you have to redo the chat that you've just had. It's weird, isn't it? Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How are you? <laughs> I'm okay. I'm not too bad. Um, I'm very excited because um, this is rather strange for me because I grew up with the story of Tracy Beaker. And when I discovered your Twitter, I was like, is that what? It's, and, and here we are. Um, so I'm chatting to Amber herself. I'm not going to lie, Alicia. When I was younger, when you were wearing the head bandana, you scared me a little bit. <laughs> I think she tends to scare a lot of people, but uh, I've, I've decided to, to leave that for today. So I'm uh, <laughs> back to my natural best, <laughs> hopefully. Is it weird for you to um, re-talk about Tracy B. Cat after all these years? It is, because in a way it seems like an absolute lifetime ago, but then in another in another way it just it seems like I literally just finished it yesterday. It's um it's it's been a really nostalgic week, I have to say. Um I think the new series is great, um and it's been it's been great to kind of touch base with all the original characters and just to see what they're doing and what they're up to and yeah, it's 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 been it's been a really, really funny week, really nostalgic. Um, of course, you know, I didn't realise, but the second series of Tracy Beaker was actually filmed in Cardiff. So it was filmed just where you were from. What was that like? Yeah, because, well, I, I'm originally from Newport, um, but I attended uh, this Cardiff drama workshop. So my mum and dad used to take me to that in Cardiff every Thursday night. Um, basically like a kind of drama acting workshop, but it's also like a casting agency as well, which was run by like an ex-director. And um, word got out that the production team of Tracy Beaker was moving to Cardiff because the producers were Welsh and they wanted it to be filmed in their hometown. So we're like, great. And um, they were looking for new characters. So they were looking for Amber, they were looking for Bouncer and they were looking for Lol. So of course they just happened to come down to one of our sessions. And uh, I was obviously there and uh, the rest they say is history. <laughs> and uh, do you remember the day they told you that you were gonna be in Tracy Beaker? Because you know, this had, been an established show for a year I'm guessing the reaction to it was mental so uh, was it was it a shock when you were told that you were going to be in the show it was a massive shock because it was the audition process was incredibly long it's not a case of oh you audition for it and then you get the part it was like the audition then the next audition and then next audition and next audition so it was a very long process over a good few months but I remember getting the part like it was yesterday I was at my nan's house and I think it was that either the director or the producer phoned me. And I just remember just like, just bursting into tears, like crying, screaming, and then trying to tell like my family all at the same time. And I don't know who it was, but someone actually was taking pictures as I was like hugging, like my mum and my nan. And I've, I've got to get that out somewhere. I've, I'm sure I've got all my Tracy Beaker memorabilia up in the attic, so I'm gonna have to bring that down. But it was an incredibly emotional, surreal moment. Mm -hmm. It really was. And the character of Amber certainly, uh, I would say, shook up at the dumping ground. Um, she was a little bit of a tear away, wasn't she? Oh, she was just so much fun to play. Like, it was a character I felt I could really, like, get my teeth into. Like, at that age, I was, like, 14, 15, so... I was kind of going through that kind of grungy stage anyway, where I would, you know, wear my baggy, oversized, like rock t-shirts or football t-shirts. And I'd wear like every single piece of jewelry and the eyeliner and stuff. And so it was, it was, it was kind of, it was, it was good fun. And, you know, just to see everyone's reaction to her, you know, it wasn't just Tracy Beaker anymore, who was kind of ruling the roost. It was this new character who was coming in and just shaking everything up. And I just had so much fun playing her. It was great. The thing, that, the thing that sticks in my mind with that character, is it that she she drives around, is it the lawn on the lawnmower? Is that, that is that, am I making, I'm not making that up, am I? <laughs> no, and do you know what, it's funny because that was actually one of my auditions with Kieran and Ben. Um, and we were just chatting about that literally a few days ago on Twitter. Like, oh my God, that was one of our, I, I'd sent them a picture of that. And they were like, oh my God, that can you remember that? That was one of our auditions. And um, yeah, she she steals Duke's lawnmower. She kind of jumps onto it, and um, and then she crashes it. But I actually had a stunt double to do that. So wow, I remember, I remember exclusive when... here. <laughs> <laughs> so that that scene with that that camera angle from the top where they're looking down at Amber, she crashes it. That's not actually me. That's my stunt double. And I remember thinking at the time, 
oh my god like how cool is this i've got my own stunt double like i've made it <laughs> Um, and obviously, Tracy Beaker has just returned and the internet has been set alight. People are loving the nostalgia at the minute. Uh, what are your favourite memories of being on that set? Oh, God, I, I don't think I could pick just one. Um, the, the whole experience was was just incredible and, and incredibly surreal. I mean, I, I grew up reading all of, of, of the Jacqueline Wilson books. I was an avid, avid reader growing up, still am. And the story of Tracy Beaker happened to be literally my favorite book. It was literally my favorite book. So to get that part and to walk onto that set, you know, it was an already established successful series. And then to come in as this new character and just, just to be on a TV set as well, because it was actually my first time being on a proper TV set. It was, it was just amazing. I made amazing friends and just memories just to, to treasure forever. So the whole experience was, was, was just amazing amazing you said there that you made amazing friends do you still keep in contact with any of the the cast members that you worked with yeah so you know we're, we're all kind of friends on facebook and we follow each other on twitter i mean i, I was speaking to chelsea who plays louise the other day on facebook and um and ben who plays bouncer um and i just got back in touch actually with danny on twitter so i happened to send her a few photos and she retweeted me and and then since then my twitter has just like exploded um but you know it, it, when you film something like that it's incredibly an intense you know situation and um you know you've made these great friends but then obviously you know life goes in different directions and you know we were kids at the time and we all lived in different parts of the country like you know I was in Wales and Danny was in Bracknell and, and everywhere else and Chelsea's in like Brighton or whatever so you know obviously we're going to go that way but you know this show will keep us together I think for for many many years to come and I, I really hope that one day we can get together for a reunion you know obviously it's 20 years next next year yeah. so I would love it needs to happen. A Tracy Beaker reunion with like as much as the cast as possible. It would just be amazing. I'd love, I'd love that. Well, considering all the interviews I've done for it, I'm going to crash that and I'm definitely coming. <laughs> I'm like, I am definitely not, not coming to that. Um, but Alicia, thank you so much for having a chat with me. Um, from all of us, thank you very much and, and have a wonderful day. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you for having me. <laughs>